Well, you can preserve maybe the autologous transplant for later on. If you have collected the stem cells, then maybe you can uh, give them a stem cell transplantation later on when they have a relapse. Uh, and you have uh, newer um, immunologic options, for example. Yesterday we heard about CAR T tra tra treatment in multiple myeloma. You have bispecifics. There are also already newer uh, proteasome inhibitors and uh, IMIDs. So uh, I guess combinations with these uh, medication will be in the relapse setting the, the choices, the first choices. Um, I think it's also important that we look at which patients may be in need of an autologous stem cell transplantation or not. Dr. Caffo has showed us for this morning that especially the high risk patients may profit from the autologous stem cell transplantation, which may implicate that a low risk patient or normal risk patient maybe do not. So in future studies we would like to learn from that too, if everyone needs the stem cell transplantation or maybe there are subgroups who do not.